You read the title right. I am going to remake Cookie Clicker in 48 hours. Quick side note before we start the challenge. My dad said that it would be impossible for me to reach 1,000 subscribers before the end of summer break. So make sure to subscribe to the channel to prove him wrong. Okay, on with the video. So the obvious first step to remaking a game is doing some research. Oh yeah. The second step to remaking a game is actually making the game, which, if you could believe it, is actually way harder than the first step. After creating a project, I made a canvas, made a button, recolored it, and that's a cookie. Please don't click off the video, trust me, it gets better. A little bit more programming magic, and it technically works. It's not really fun yet, so the next step is adding some buildings. I'm only going up until the mine for this video for simplicity purposes, but it's basically the same thing. Now that the cursors work, we need to add upgrades because it would be almost impossible to do anything without them, so let's get to work. After literal hours of working, I finally got to this. You may notice that the game looks a hundred times better because I replaced the plain cookie to this PNG cookie and the background to the cool stripes. The upgrades also work now, but for now it's time for me to go to sleep on day one. Starting off the next day, I added extra information when hovering over the upgrade so that you actually know the cost and what they do. I also made the numbers change to be millions and billions, but I never actually made it that high without cheating. I added pictures to each of the building buttons, and then it was time to get to work on the rest of the upgrades. This took me the rest of the day because of how tedious it was to do each upgrade, so after that, I just went to bed. <laughs> Starting off the final day, I was basically finished, so I just added cookie numbers when clicking and golden cookies. The golden cookie has a radial timer in the top left corner and also changes the background color to yellow when it is active. Overall, I'm really happy with how my first time restricted challenge ended up turning out, and make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more of this type of content. That's all for this one. Peace. Thank you.